Hey, welcome. My name is Eric. And today I'm going to say to you that I'm not anti-vax. I'm anti-gov. Welcome to the craziness that lives inside my head. Okay. I try not to be political on my podcast, okay? I try to be me. So whatever I say, I am not politically correct. And I don't know, what's the other word? I'm, uh, uh, if anything, I'm very unpolitically correct. But the thing is, I did get annoyed with this vaccination thing. I mean, if you want to get vaccinated, fine. I don't care. I mean, that is your that is your right. That is, in my opinion, that is your right. Now, I will say this because they always say, "Well, those the vaccinated, uh, the unvaccinated people are the ones who's causing all these variants." And as far as I'm concerned, that's bullshit. But anyway, it's your body, but we all have to take responsibility. If I know, and I, I know it's a hard thing to say, if I don't get vaccinated and I would have come down with COVID or any kind of disease, it's my then whatever happens to me, I have to own up to it. That's all I'm saying. Because the government, I guess, made it possible, possible for me to protect myself. I guess. I'm always saying I'm guess. But I am anti-gov when it comes to pushing people to do things against their will. Now, come being a black African-American, no, my ancestors know all about government pushing them to, you know, doing what they don't want to do. And that's, that's the problem that I have. Um, and, and for the government, instead of being transparent about what's going on with this COVID thing, um, they fear mongering, you know, but in 2020, there were so many uh, reports about how many people died from COVID, providing it's from COVID. I mean, then they said a lot of those people already had a pre existence illness. Well, did they die from the pre existent illness or did they die from COVID? How do you know they died from COVID? I mean, then they said COVID complications. So if they didn't get COVID, they would have probably still alive, be alive. I don't know. I just I don't know. Like I said before, if those if if I don't if, if somebody wants to be vaccinated, let them be vaccinated. If somebody don't want to be vaccinated, then that's their choice. But don't don't make them the scapegoat of what's going on. I might have had made a podcast about this before. I'm not sure. But I'm going to be honest with you. I am not anti-vax, but I am surely anti-gov. Because government, you don't know what the government is doing behind closed doors. Does that, does that saying, I put this on Facebook, money talks, bullshit walks. And and a lot of people, I uh, had a friend who would say to me, do you know how many politicians became rich after they got into office? No, I don't. Maybe somebody should do a study on it. They do a study on everything else. Maybe so much. How much taxes do uh, politicians pay? Do they pay taxes? They should. I pay taxes. Do they pay the, the amount, the same amount of tax as a private a citizen would would pay, making that the whatever money they're making? I don't know. They need to do a study on it. They do a study on everything else. I don't know. All I know is. I do not like, and a lot of people, I'm not alone. A lot of people probably do not like our government telling us what to do when we don't know what's going on in the background and they're not being transparent about. And first of all, because lately, uh, didn't these uh, pharmaceutical companies making all this money on this vaccine? And who's paying for it? I'm paying for it. I'm not even taking the vaccine, and I'm paying for it. Why? 
because it's the taxes and then our taxes go up and the inflation go up and I keep thinking now I'm not a conspiracy person but it seems to me that this COVID thing the one thing they did it did do it made some people poor and it kept everybody at the same plane nobody got ahead well the only people got ahead of obviously was the rich people but if you was in middle class on the way you know and below either you you lost your place on the scale of wealth or you became or you just stayed the same that's why I'm anti-gov I keep thinking the government is there to keep people in their place they only allow certain people to be rich but majority of them the government seems to want you to depend upon them at all times this way they can keep you in your place my name is Eric and thank you for listening to this craziness that lives inside my head